to know the lingo too when we're listening to our meteorologists. I mean, one of the most common questions I get asked, whether it's at a school, a nursing home, a church, wherever, is okay, tell me the difference between a watch and a warning. And I know some of you are probably rolling your eyes going, oh, I learned that in grade school. Well, you know what? The words look similar and they are about the same length and they can be confusing. So remember a watch, put on your binoculars. We're watching out. There's a chance severe weather will happen. Warning, think of your mama getting so irritated with you and you are getting that warning and you know you've got to act straight. Well, you're getting the warning. You need to go to your safe spot. And also, y'all know where you live. Know your county. Know where you live in the county. And that's really going to help you out as far as those storms moving in. Because say the system's moving in from our west, pushing eastward, and you live just go over into Dixon. Well, it's going to be helpful to know where in Dixon County you live. So just a few little things to go over. And sunny days are always a good one to get that checked off the list. It's amazing how much people will learn and listen. And the more you can just make that part of your normal motion rather than getting into a panic and just kind of a tizzy and forgetting this will really help you out. Today is going to be lovely, just a little chilly. Current temperature 49 degrees right now. You had your way just over to Murfreesboro, 49 degrees for y'all as well. We had some showers trying to linger overnight. That was anticipated. We still have one or two small sprinkles across the plateau. This is not going to add up to too much and it's going to quickly continue to move its way just off to our east. Something else that's shifting eastward are the clouds behind this. We're going to have high pressure and that's going to allow for a lot of sunshine to be with us today and we'll have a very easy weather day, but dramatically colder. Look at this cold air shifting its way in right now over Nashville. We're at 49 and then you make your way into Atlanta coming in at 64. It'll be cold before you know it. And we are seeing some even colder spots right here at home. 41 right now over in Murray, 47 in Camden, 48 in Bowling Green, and then we've got 50s across the plateau. Wind's still a little breezy, nothing extreme like what we had yesterday, but it's noticeable that the wind being out of our north. Plenty of sunshine today, mostly clear skies as we make our way overnight tonight. And then as we ease closer into Good Friday, we're going to be quite dry all day long, but you're going to notice a few clouds starting to skirt in, especially areas closer to our Kentucky Tennessee state line. As far as rain is concerned, we will see a chance for some scattered rain showers late Friday into early Saturday. The severe threat, just generic thunderstorms, not looking at anything too extreme, but we're not going to be finished with the rain for the weekend. You'll notice we'll see a chance for some showers as we make our way into Saturday early morning areas south of I 40 going into Sunday, and then things will clear out for majority of us on Easter Sunday afternoon itself. 66 degrees today, 75 tomorrow, Easter Sunday, 65 for your afternoon high. We'll see showers and thunderstorms moving back in late Sunday into early Monday with dry conditions back on Tuesday. That high 65 degrees perspective wise though, Rebecca, the average high for this time of year is 72. Oh. So we're going to get there, but then we do stay rather cool.